Hey guys, welcome back for another Green Box Grown product review video. Today I'm going to be reviewing Humida Packs for curing your cannabis buds. So I use the Bovida Humida Packs. There's this newer brand, Boost, which I have a sample of. I haven't used them yet, but it is kind of cool because they do come with a replacement indicator which shows when the Humida Pack needs to be replaced. Uh, but like I said, I haven't used these yet. What I have used is Bovida. These are these guys have been around for a very long time and are trustworthy. Uh, I use the 62%. That's pretty much the one ideal for curing cannabis. And if you are using the quart-sized mason jars for curing, you're going to want to use the 8 gram Humida Pack. So for those of you who don't know, humida packs are used for, well, regulating the humidity inside the jar that you are curing your buds in. Um, and the ideal humidity for curing is around 62%. So these regulate the, the atmosphere within so that it stays at that percentage of humidity, allowing the buds to cure. Um, without drying out too much or being too moist and uh, getting moldy. So this is some super jack, these are some super jack buds that are already cured, finished curing. Um, they're really dense now. I mean, when we harvested them, they're fluffy, uh, a little bigger. And now you can feel they're not crunchy, but they are dense and solid like a nug should be. Um, and these are the Blue Dream ones that we harvested a few weeks after. So these are not quite finished, but they're still coming pr along pretty well. Before I used Humidipax, um, most times, because I live in a really dry climate, so a lot of times the buds would get crunchy after a while being in the jar. And, you know, you don't really want that. It loses effect. And the THC... Uh, the trichomes fall off much easier from the buds when it dries out like that. Um, so since then, since I've started using these, the buds have been curing perfectly and I've had no issues. No mold issues, they aren't getting crispy, they're just, like I said, drying and curing to perfection. Smell, it also helps with developing the smell keeping that ideal environment. So basically, once you put them in the jars with one of these packs, all you gotta do is, you know, like usual, burp them once every day. Um, and then after about a month, they'll be good to go. And you can continue curing them after that point, uh, just for an even more potent and higher quality product. But you can start smoking usually after four weeks in the jar. Alright guys, thank you for watching, and as always, please don't forget to subscribe and comment below with your feedback, and as always, happy growing.